I feel like I'm pushed to the greatest potential here at Vanderbilt Eye Institute. Some institutions are there to train you, but at Vanderbilt Eye Institute, we're here to invest in you. We look for people that want to push the bar. The Vanderbilt Eye Institute is special because of its culture. Having been a trainee that graduated the Vanderbilt Retina Fellowship, the people here were invested not only in my professional growth, but my personal growth. No one gets to where they are in their career without mentorship. And it's our goal as faculty members to provide the same mentorship for our trainees that was provided to us. At Vanderbilt, every individual we train is unique, and we let them define themselves, learn their own identity, and we give them the resources and mentoring and uh, opportunities to reach their fullest potential in life. Our culture of collaboration and interdisciplinary approaches is unique among I institutes. We're all on one campus. What that means is that all the fantastic research that's happening in the lab can translate into our clinics. It is a professional imperative for all of us to come together as a department to really make sure that diversity, equity, and inclusion are at the forefront of how we train. As soon as I came to Nashville, everyone made me feel right at home. The city is growing so much and that energy is really palpable. You get all of the amenities of a large city, but at the same time you have the warmth and connection of a small town. The opportunity here is really endless. Faculty members will do anything they can to help promote our residents. I meet with trainees every six months to talk about not only their career goals, but also to discuss their goals around wellness. There really is no other institution in the country that has this personality. When I tell people that I graduated from the Vanderbilt Fellowship, that means something. We're looking for those individuals that are motivated to improve care and to do something for the greater impact of our patients and society.